Dang girl, bye. Whatever, 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 one more time. Get low, get low, get low, get low. Do you know this one? To the window, to the wall, to the sweat drop down my ball. What the fuck? Oh, skate, skate, goddamn. Uh oh, shit, shit, got a fuck What's up, everybody? They tried earlier. They were like, why don't we just bring you up to Smash Mouth? I'm like, no. <laughs> Does anybody here watch Lifetime movies? Woo! You do? Woo. You've actually watched them? Yes. I don't know about You. Okay, that's, that, that's the best thing. No, I watched them. I just don't know you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just watched the good ones. Uh, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I am, um, yeah, I'm an eight of them. <laughs> yeah, eight Lifetime movies. Uh, let's see. Stalked by my mother. Look Who's Stalking. Malicious Motive. Psycho BFF. Deep Blue Nightmare. Deadly Garage Sale. <laughs> yeah, I literally, like, robbed garage sales and, like, killed HOA ladies. It was so fun. I got recognized the other day, so literally. <laughs> oh my god, sorry. I was just talking to myself. I uh, <laughs> I got recognized the other day, and this girl come up to me, and she's like, "Oh my god, I know you." And I was like, "This is at TJ Maxx, by the way." Um, I was like, "You know me?" She's like, "Yeah, from health class." I'm like, "What?" She's like, yeah, aren't you in that video crying that you have chlamydia? <laughs> and the worst part is it says, not an actor, guys. <laughs> but I, I like was recognized the other day and I was babysitting while I was recognized and like a girl did come up to me and she was like, you were in that garage sale movie. She goes, I didn't know you were a mom. I was like, I'm not. And it's weird being a babysitter because like, kids... I, the kids were like, why are you my babysitter if you do movies? <laughs> and I was like, oh, you know. And they're like, can we watch your movies? And I go, no, you're not old enough. So then they just told their parents that I do adult films. So, which is wrong because I'm actually a stripper. So <laughs> I'm getting, I, um, anybody else a stripper? No, just me. I'm not a stripper. I think it's weird, though, when people Yelp review strip clubs. <laughs> yeah, like I saw one the other day that uh, I saw a Yelp review for a strip club, and it said, uh, tits were great, fries were soggy. <laughs> it's just so stupid, man. Who's dating in here? <laughs> Y'all are single. <laughs> I'm only one getting laid. Fuck. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm sorry. So nobody's dating. <laughs> That's so sad. I'm literally so sorry. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> Who's a straight man? Anybody? Me. You're a straight man. You're a man. You're a straight man. You're a straight man. Okay. Man, that was shy. You're like, <laughs> you're right here. I don't want to talk about it, but I'm fucking straight. <laughs> don't tell the person I'm with, but yeah, I'm fucking straight. Um... <laughs> Man, straight people are weird. I mean, I'm sh I'm straight. I've told you that. But, like, straight guys are weird. Like, guys are weird because they just assume women want to live with them. Like, my boyfriend, like, I left a hairband in his house, and he's like, you're obsessed with me. <laughs> he's like, you want to see me again? I was like, that's, like, not true. Um, but whatever. And he said that, like, uh, he goes, yeah, girls leave stuff at, at guys' houses to see them again. If you're a man, who thinks that's true? No, none of y'all. Y'all are being shy. You think it's true. Did she do it to you? Y'all aren't dating, though. Okay, well, that's... It's sexist. I think it's really sexist. So instead of, like, leaving things at men's houses to see them again, I like to, like, turn the tables. Like, right, it's super cute. Uh, I just like to rob men instead. So I'm like, you know what? I did need a new microwave, right? <laughs> My boyfriend does commercial real estate. <laughs> cool. Um, 
I'm an actor. And so, like, we don't understand the same things. Like, he, like, lost a $3 million deal the other, other day. And he's like, I lost a $3 million deal. I'm like, oh, that's so sad, babe. But can you, like, take photos of my hands for this audition? <laughs> and then he took the photos. Side note, director, producers loved me, okay? Um, sent hand photos, never heard back. So I sent an email, like he would send an email, and I'd go, to whom it may concern, uh, I want to do a follow-up email on my hands. <laughs> they went in a di different direction, guys. So um, it was weird being in that situation with my boyfriend, because it was like the first time I was mad that I didn't get the hand job. So <laughs> I'm going to end on this one. <laughs> Anybody's grandma's getting scammed? <laughs> No, just my Nona. That's great. Um, she'll get calls like, um, she'll be like, she'll get calls of like, hey, this is your grandkid. Uh, can you bail me out of jail with 17 Amazon gift cards? And she'll believe it. And she got a call the other day and it was, she was like, I won $1.5 million. We're like, how? She's like, oh, I just had to send three cashier checks that equaled $130,000. And she did it, guys. Yeah. Um, but on the bright side, at least now I have $130,000. So if anybody needs me to scam their Nona, <laughs> are we ready for this show? <clears throat>